1st of August. I am at the Iron House, Birmingham. And what's going on today is an amazing exhibition by Janet Douglas called The Chapters of Our Life. The Chapters of Our Lives is a storytelling exhibition and it's about reviving all those photographs that we have in boxes at home or we've got stored in our phones that we never really look at. So it's about picking out these photographs and telling what was the reason behind it, what, what happened on that day, what happened at that particular moment. So I interviewed 10 different people, asked them for their favourite photograph or photographs and asked them to talk to me about them. And it's, it's all about getting all these stories out here before it's too late. So having everybody here today is really important because it's going to get people talking, reminiscing about times that was, good times, bad times, um, and just interacting and having a great time. This one, with my mum first coming over to the UK. My mum was a seamstress. Um, she made that dress that she has on, and she taught me how to sew fashion. While she was sewing on a, um, a Singer machine, I was using the Holly Hobby one right next to her, so she taught me all these things. So this one rings out to me, stay dignified, focus on who you are, be who you are, with a beautiful smile, no matter what's going on. It's a powerful image for me, it's just very, pure and gentle and peaceful and powerful. One of me and my dad here, this is when we was in London and we went to uh, see Azimuth at Ronnie Scott's. Uh, that was a really, really good gig. It's a uh, picture of my dad, my grandfather and my uncle Tony. All creatives as well. My grandfather was a tailor in, in Birmingham, a famous tailor. Uh, my uncle was a also DJ. So one of the uh, standout pictures for me is myself as a young child. Um, this is where I ended up uh, having the ambition to always travel, to always go, to explore, try something new. It would be one of the, my favourite pictures of myself because I, was, I had so much commitment, so much conviction about what I wanted. And I was dead set about it, so I was so thorough. It definitely is. Um, from all of the memories that I have, it's definitely one of the pictures that I would say um, shows my personality the most. Truly humbled and, you know, honoured that um, uh, Janet who curated this exhibition has invited me to come over and uh, sh share, my, share my story really. So yeah, uh, definitely a privilege. I feel so humbled to share um, our story, not just mine, but my family's story. It's a pleasure to work with so many different people on this project and hearing different stories and tales from different people's lives. I just think it's a privilege and I'm so blessed and grateful to be a part of this um, exhibition with Janet Douglas. I think it's important to show you the history of things and where we come from, how time has really gone by. So it's like a cycle of things where I look back at the pictures of myself carrying a suitcase and I've got very vivid memories of that. But then I look at, back at my parents being parents and I think that's a future that I want to be able to have with my own children when that time comes. So to share that experience with people, I hope they get it. I hope it makes sense even though it's not very well connected to the business. Being in swimming, you know, talking about generational um, education, life-saving skills and things like that. But we're getting to that point now where having a thorough understanding of the history is helping me to set out the future and I really love the fact that I was able to share that in the exhibition today.